Hello, people of God. It's Pastor Stephen with vlog number 302 for Thursday, October 26. I'm in room eight, and this is the place where I teach confirmation, but tonight it's missions committee. And uh, what's what are some of the, I want you just to tell about some of the missions that our church supports. What's going on? Michelle? Uh, well, one of the newest missions we've taken on is the Lighthouse in conjunction with Hope Rescue Mission. It's the Women's and Children's Center for Homeless Women. Uh, they had nowhere to really go before. And we purchased um, blankets and sheets and things for them this year. And um, they just opened up, I think it was in June. Excellent. Brenda, what do you have? So one of the other um, missions that we support is called the caring closet and it's money that we collect from our congregation we do it over the summer into the fall and this year we collected I believe it was five hundred dollars right mm -hmm. five hundred dollars total and then what we do is we give that to the Danny Moon High School and they distribute that money over throughout all the school district and it's used for students who who are homeless who might need something it's the gift card was for Amazon so they could literally purchase anything that the students might need. And it's really for people who are struggling, who may be hungry or who need something, you know, school supplies, um, clothing, any of those kinds of things that they would need to get, so. Thank you, Brenda. Yeah. Linda, what else? Um, we were talking tonight about preparing gifts, snack gift baskets for the Christmas season. And they go out to like Amity Manor and Birdsboro Lodge, oh, good. and as well as the fire companies and uh, the police. Thank you, Judy Ritz. Uh, well, we have the Wish Tree, and that project has been going on for nearly thirty years, mm. and it's it's changed a little bit now. We are going to be giving uh, gift cards. To sit for 60 children. Uh, the gift cards uh, are from kindergarten to fourth grade, and the gift cards are given to their parents to purchase gifts for the kids at Christmas. Excellent. And Sarah Trejo is setting that up. She just yes, had an announcement is. on Sunday. Mm -hmm. Judy? Yes. Uh, the group we support is one of the groups is the Bethany Children's Home in Reading, and uh, we give them money to help support the children that are brought in yeah. as parents. Or, so. yeah. Thanks. Okay. And do you have a thumbs up to all that, Kathy? <laughs> and I know that uh, Jackie was in here a little earlier, right? But she's going down to choir rehearsal. Maybe I can catch the choir. Right now. All right. Well, thank you for the work that you're doing to coordinate all our efforts. And right across the hall, the Girl Scouts are meeting. Hi there. We're doing a vlog for the church. I guess you don't really have to know exactly what's going on but they're having a lot of fun oh, hey everybody i'm pastor steven say hi. and this is you can say hello to all the church members that are watching yeah are you having a fun time here all right that's all i wanted to know we'll see you later then all right in our prayer concerns um, one of our members spoke to me after the the service Sunday and said we should have on our sign pray for peace so I put that on the sign and uh, whether you see the sign or drive by it or not you should be praying for peace in the world especially with what we see going on in Israel right now we talked about that the last vlog a little bit and um, also we're praying for Larry Mench he's been in the hospital with some heart issues I saw him yesterday and uh, the choir is also rehearsing right now and you get to hear them rehearse. So I am doing a vlog right here. And just a, a moment ago, I heard you singing A Mighty Fortress. Can I get you all, can you give an opening note? It's 151. Sure. Just to hear... How about we do the whole first verse of that? A mighty fortress is I've got 151. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, half the choir is not here tonight, but still, you're going strong. I could hear you through through the floor. All right, yeah. we'll sing quieter. No, no. <laughs>
there you have it. That is our uh, Reformation song for Reformation Sunday. We'll be opening the service with that this coming Sunday. And uh, our scripture for today is Jesus replied, love the Lord your God with all your heart and all your soul and all your mind. This is the first and greatest commandment. And that's from Matthew 22, 37 to 38. And the choir sings, Amen. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> I should have said that that way. Let's try it one more time, one more time. <laughs>